Oh, I love that camera. It just looks so much better. It has, um, it has a big presence. It does. I feel like I'm like, like really filmed. Like I feel the filming now. It's like, show me. Look like. Oh, this one's swap. So that's the one that's swap? It's gotta be. Oh, dang. This one's a swap <laughs> dial, isn't it? Remember we had a, Margo. Sw a swap dial? That's a swap dial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't have so that, it's right? it's 2004 with the Tritium. Yeah, Tritium, With the Tritium. Yeah. Okay. Tritium hands as well. Oh, see, I'm noticing that. Train me well. Train me well. Um, yeah, we won't give him 7500 No, exactly. So... What do you want to trade this back in for? We bought it for seventy five. We want to get it back for six. Six. Yeah. Come on, man. I know. You just bought two. Sixty five. Yeah. Don't. Don't. Yeah. It's too much. All right. You want to just get it for seven? Sell it for seventy five again, Margo? Yeah. I All can right. sell that again. Okay. Actually, what I'm gonna do is Flat. post it in Rolex forms because here's. I guarantee you, on Rolex forms, there's a guy who, who has a. Title? No. I, there's probably a guy out there that has one with a service doll in hands. And I can be like, well, I have the tritium doll in hands. I'll yeah. swap you. Yeah. Oh, no, I didn't see, bro. Okay, so <clears throat> one second. Tell me what the tell me what the deal is. The day dress is twelve five, and I can give you seven for yours. So that's fifty five hundred difference. Oh my days! That's the price, man. That's the market. You want a blue stick? <laughs> if you want a smooth bezel, or you know. Mm. Bro, let's do a deal, okay? I'm trying. Let me see here. Hold on. I got 5k cash from you. I mean, I can look, I can't even do that because there's tax associated. Oh man, you're kidding me. I mean, you, you, you bought from us, you know, there's tax involved. I know, but just call it a discount, bro. Four for watch, come on. Uh -uh, man. Hey, I work here, I gotta pay tax. So we're being generous and giving you seven when you pay 75. So that's a, that's a strong number that we're giving you for yours. 205 for this good, we need a good number on that on that one 205 is you know you that's you've below, seen the market that's below market and for a blue stick jubilee fluted papers complete so yeah. we're, we're talking about the bands you mentioned a rubber strap that's cool easy. you know you can swap that out that's easy getting you another factory oyster band that's gonna cost uh -huh. you some thousands so how I don't, much would it be bro man probably like two 2500 i don't know if it'd be yeah, worth I, it I, I ordered one, but it was like three years ago, so I don't know what the price is now. But I when I when the first time I bought one, uh, I think it was like $1,700, but it was like three, four years ago. Yeah, a little bit more. I mean, if you want one, obviously yeah. I can source one for you. I just want you to know what you're walking into. Yeah, no, I would definitely uh, want you to try to find me one, brand new, preferably, or, you know, in good condition. <laughs> if you want one, I can do that. I just know the rubber straps are, you know. A few hundred. Did you, check, did you check with Marco if he has any black rubber strap in stock? <clears throat> I can check for the rubber strap. I was checking for the oyster for you. If you can check with him. Okay. Okay, check with him on the on the black rubber strap, mm -hmm. and then I'll call you two minutes. Okay. Okay, that'll work. Thank you, bro. Bye. No problem. How you doing today? I'm good. It's Friday, so I can't complain. Man, we woke up saying the same exact thing. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. No, I've been trying to locate this Omega for you, the Planet Ocean. Normally, man, those are hot watches uh, or easy to come by, but it, uh, I put a few calls out. Uh, like I said, I have the black one, but you prefer the blue dial yeah. over the black, correct? Um, I tried both of them on. I've always worn the blue Omega anyway, so it just, yeah, I just definitely instead on the blue one. Yeah, and that's not a problem. Let me put a couple more calls out, and uh, like I said, I haven't gotten anything back. I at least wanted you to call me so you have my direct number. I know I kind of yeah. miss some messages sometimes on IG. Appreciate it. Yeah, I figured your IG is getting blown up right now, so it probably works better for you. Yeah, save this number. Uh, you can text me, call me at any time. I work 24 hours, but uh, I'll keep you updated with what I get back and see if I we can make this work. And uh, brand new is a must, correct? Uh, no, actually, I would prefer pre-owned just because, um, I, I think for me, it's like, because if it's new, I might as well just get a page since it's, they gave me a pretty good price on it. Mm -hmm. But, um, the, the reason why I went to you guys is because, 
Um, I saw that black one that's forty two fifty, and I figured if I could get it around the same price, I would right. very likely go with you guys. Okay. Let me see what I can do this weekend, and uh, I'll lock your number in, and uh, we'll be in touch, okay? I appreciate it. Absolutely. You have a great day. You too. Thanks, Vic. You're welcome. Right. Bye-bye. Bye. All right. So I'll put a call out for that one. Look, uh, Dylan, if you get somebody, so, you know, we have, we have the black one. Mm -hmm. I put a few calls out on that blue one, and man, nothing. New mm -hmm. pre-owned. Yeah, so I'm gonna put another call out, but if you happen to come across one, I'll, I'll put a call out myself. Let's see what I can find. No, I appreciate it. Unless it's like new old stock or something. Oh, here you go. I'm putting on my backpack, guys. Why do you have a backpack on, Alfred? Uh, cause I am in and out of this office, uh, at, like all the time. But when I'm here sitting, I do take my backpack off. But usually when I'm caught on camera wearing my backpack, I'm always either coming in or going out. Got here an Audemars PA, and I got here a Fraudemars PA. Just get that out of here. Get that out of my face. Let me see. But, but yeah, 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 check it out. Look at the differences. Um, Fraudemars PA. Fraudemars. <laughs> So, it's got the missing screws. Yeah, you got missing, you got missing screws in there. Yeah, missing screw complication. That's funny. Let me see the face. So this one's clearly taking, and that one is like an imitation automatic. Hey, Victor. How are you, bro? I'm doing great. How you doing? Hey, doing good, man. I appreciate it. I'm the guy yeah. that had that so 6 man. I know you got that Pontiac, yeah. right? So yeah. got it. I still do, man. I'm actually uh, getting some work <laughs> done as we speak. You say you got the Z06? I had a C6, uh, C6. Uh, Z06, yeah. and then I sold it. Um, sold it last year. Um, I should have kept it because right now they're going for like 10 grand more than I sold it for, man. Man, it's crazy, right? The market's nuts. It is. I wish I would have held. But the good thing is, I sold it because I copped a, a few watches. So I copped like a Yacht Master One, um, an Explorer One, mm -hmm. and then I just got this AP 15450, so 37 millimeter. Yep. And all, all of those ones were from like the actual AD, and all of them have been slowly going up. So I really like that uh, brown leather strap day date, and I want to get into, I don't have any gold. Mm -hmm. And I want to get into something gold. I just want to know if it's like fully complete, like what year and the model and all that good stuff so I can do some research on it. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I mean, I could give you the reference number. We'll give a box to our retail customers. It doesn't have the original box or papers. However, that price that I advertise, you'll notice uh, is extremely aggressive. I'm really just putting that price out there today to get this gone. Cause I have it on my website right now, it's 21.5. No way. Cause that's the market, you know? So we have to price according to the market, but I went ahead and threw that out there. Cause I had another guy working a deal on it. And uh, just trying to move it, that's all. But uh, I can send more pictures, extremely clean. So, no box and no papers, you said? I'll give, a, you'll have a Rolex box. It won't be the original box, but you'll have a genuine Rolex box. Genuine Rolex box, um, papers and warranty card? No, no, uh-uh, not at that price, no, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, damn, see, that's a, because this is gonna be for my wife. Um, she's really wanting to get into something gold. It's gone through, right? Like, it's gone through and verified top to bottom? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Everything that we everything that we get in. I mean, I can get you one with papers, but to give you an idea, you're going to be around 22 to 23. Yeah. can't do that much right now. Yeah. Okay, so this this is a good price point. Um, let me let me think about it. Let me talk to her. But I, I really like it, man. Can you give me the reference number? Okay. Yeah, what I'll do, I'm going to send you a link. And that way you can see all the pictures. It has a reference number and a few additional pictures that what you may have seen. Perfect, perfect. Thank you. I really appreciate it, man. And then we'll be in touch. I'll let you know today either way we go. So okay. you're not hanging around. No problem. Oh, Look I forward. appreciate it, Victor. Take yes, care, sir. bro. No problem. I'll send that link to all you right, right now. Awesome. Thanks, man. All right. Bye-bye. Uh, okay, let me see your watch right here. Oh, yeah, that thing looks like Darby skated it. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> You don't get care if I just like bang it around, do you? I wouldn't do it any more damage. Yeah, I know. <laughs>
Can you show me I mean, the conditions right? of these swatches are pretty. Uh, yeah. I mean, this one's a lot better than this one. He's up. But, but this thing is just chewed up because this guy goes skateboarding, longboarding. What else do you do in it? I don't want to know. Don't oh, answer you that question. On the Cartiers, on the set, it looks like a sapphire. Uh, yeah. the blue sapphire. So, blue here, total, and then that day, 75 plus test is 811, and you already gave us a thousand, so you're 7118. Cool, okay. And I'll just put that in there. Yeah, this, Your this birthday, when was it? Today? Today? Yeah, happy birthday, man. Appreciate it, bro. Yes, sir. That's fun. All right, all right. Thank you. When I'm to help you out, if you ever need sure. anything, sure. save my number. Sure. Okay. Feel free to reach out. Uh -huh. I got you, man. Appreciate all right. it. Happy yes. birthday again. Appreciate it. Thanks for doing business. Nice to meet you, man. Right. Hey, how are you doing, bud? Doing great. Marco, Marco is going to send you his address for you to send him an iron. <laughs> I don't think he'll use it. You don't think he'll use it? <laughs> you bet your ass I will. <laughs> How are you doing today, man? I'm doing great. I'm excited. Sweet, man. Well, hey, I have the watch in my hand right now. And the, the watch is, uh, has, a, has a service card. It is not complete, complete. Yeah, I understand. And I'm That's looking at the edges polish. right now. You look at the chamfers on the case. You see how they're uh, pronounced? I can't, I can't hear it too well. Say it one more time, Marco. Right. I'm trying to say the chamfers on the case are very well pronounced. The pinholes on the case are also um, very crisp. They're not rounded off, which is a typical sign of polish. So, okay. I mean, the watch looks un very unpolished. Gotcha. And so, so in your opinion, you think it's unpolished? For sure, yeah. Okay. And then the, you said the papers, it, it's not the correct papers, there's service papers, is that right? Yes, sir. Okay, when was it serviced? Uh, let me, uh, I'd, I'd have, have your, to pull out the card. Get your eyes on everything before you say what it has, just to verify. Yeah, it came with a service card. You sure? Yeah, for sure. Give me just one moment, we're trying to locate that. It could, that, that it could be in the safe, though. When a watch is serviced, doesn't it have come with a little bit of a warranty with it, or is it just? Uh, typically, yes, uh, but good. depending when it was serviced, it's only good for like uh, I believe a year or two years. Yeah, twelve months. Yeah, I think it's twelve months if I, if I remember right. Yeah, if you can get the that detail, that'd, that'd be great. Um, I believe so if, if I remember yeah, right, the uh, the service card was already long expired. It was just it just had it. But we warranty the watch for a year anyways when you buy it from us. Uh, I understand. I appreciate that. But yeah, so I mean. It doesn't have papers, I mean, that's kind of a bummer. Um, but no, I think, I think that's okay. It does have the box though, correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, and like, uh, and, like and Alfred does Alfred does have one that is coming unpolished that that is complete complete for eleven five. A Swiss only? Yeah. Swiss only. Yeah. Swiss when did you get that? Uh, yes, since I would, he actually has a Swiss only sub too. Yeah, can we get both? Uh huh. Yes, sir. We have yeah. both coming in. Um, what year is that one that's coming in? Do you know? Is it 98 or 99? Do you know which year that one is that's coming in, Alfred? Uh, I believe they're A serials, but I wouldn't know until I actually have my eyes on them. He says he wouldn't know until he has his hands on the watch, but he believes he was told it was an A serial. Gotcha. Man, you guys make this real difficult, don't you? The decisions. We like to give you options. I like that. I like options too. Uh, when's the watch supposed to arrive in your possession? I sent some labels yesterday. So, probably Monday. So, the watch should be here around Monday or Tuesday. No. Yeah, I'd probably like to get the, the one with, you know, that's complete. So, yeah, once you get the watch, um, you can verify everything to, you know, kosher with it. Um, give, give me an email or a text or a call. Yeah, absolutely. And, uh, I'd probably want to move forward on that, on that other one. That's yeah, complete. I'm expecting it to be in, like, pretty good condition. This guy was took really good care of his watches. Most people do when they buy something fancy. He has that and a Swiss only sub too, which is pretty cool. So. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Right on. Yeah, I'll probably do that. Um, I'd like I'd like to be the buyer for that for that piece. Um, you know, like a complete set. Cool. Sounds good, man. Well, I will give you a call as soon as it comes in. Okay. Awesome. Appreciate it. Sounds Thank good, bud. Time, Absolutely. Have a good day. All right. We'll talk soon.
Bay. Yeah, Mark, hey. nice to talk to you, man. How good, are you doing? good. How are you? How are you? I'm a big fan of the channel. That's the only reason I'm consigning with you guys. I love the channel. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Um, so I guess recap me on what's going on. Yeah, so basically, um, look, I have, a, I have a few watches, meaning uh, if you were to add them up, they're upwards of 100 grand that I want to sell. Okay. Uh, but obviously, I haven't had any business transactions with you guys. I just want to be, uh, make myself comfortable. So I'm just starting with a Submariner. Uh, sorry, yeah, I'm starting with a Submariner, and there's a Daytona, and there's a Wimbledon, and so on that I want to follow up with. I just want to get a better sense of what the consignment process looks like. I've never sold a watch. I've always bought a watch in my life, never sold one, right? Right. So what guarantees do I have that, obviously you're not going to do it, but what guarantees do I have my safety on my watch, this Submariner I'm consigning now, and it will become more important when I try to sell my KK8 Platinum. Um, so basically the way the process works is we would send you a consignment agreement. You'd, we'd fill it out with a serial number, itemized everything that we're getting from you, and then um, it's docu signed. The consignment agreement kind of highlights, you know, the whole legalities of everything, like who owns what, how it's functioned, and um, you know how it works. Basically, I mean, it falls under our responsibility 100% uh, once it leaves your hands. So if anything happens to the watch. Uh, we are 100% responsible for it. I mean, we do have insurance and so forth in place. So, I mean, knock on wood, we've never had a claim. So that's good. So, and then once you've uh, signed that, then you'd get a FedEx label fully insured to our store. And then um, it's good to go from there. You usually give us about 30 days to sell a watch. After that, we could renew the uh, agreement or re return the watch. For Submariner, I would assume that the market is strong enough or liquid enough to get it out as soon as possible, right? Yes, um, depending which, I mean, what's the Submariner, I guess? Is it a brand new ceramic sub model? It's a brand new 2021, uh, like two months ago. That, that'll sell fast. Yeah, I'm confident. I can't give you, I, you know, I can't give you an exact, you know, time when it'll sell, but I can tell you it's probably going to be between one to two weeks. And how about uh, a Daytona, the black Daytona, that's a 2019. 2019 black, It'll we'll probably try to sell that for like 30 uh, to 31, um, but that might be a little slower because there seems to be a few of those on the market lately. Black is also, you know, the, the lesser of the desirable, the two watches. Um, yeah. So everybody seems to want the white doll. Thank you so much for your help. Uh, if you want to add it over to Ricky, I'll want to Perfect, thank you so much. Yes, of course. Okay, and it will be short to the full amount that if it gets lost, I get paid. Exactly. Okay, and then last but not least, and maybe there are more questions that will come to my mind, but how do I get paid finally when you sell the watch? Well, as soon as you, we sell the watch, you'll get a wire transfer. Perfect. Well, thank you, Sri, and yes, well, I'll get that started. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. Yeah.